My soul brings tears to angelic eyes. Larry Sweeney, you're heading down a path that very few men <laughs> choose. I'm one of those men. The path you've chosen was to break a cardinal rule, an unwritten rule in professional wrestling, where no matter how much you hate the man in the ring, you do not try to take away his career, his living. You do not take food out of his mouth. You do not take food off his table to provide for his family. At the Young Lions Cup night three in the arena, that's what you tried to do. You wrapped the tape around my throat and you just kept on squeezing, squeezing, <laughs> and squeezing to the point where I threw up on myself. For the first time, I had to be helped to the back. And when I went home that night and I sat in my misery, in my room in the dark, I thought about it. And I thought about, are you truly ready to reap what you sow? Because like it's really I am. <laughs> and I've been ready ever since the day I was born. All the times I try to injure Hero, every time I try to injure Quack, every time I try to injure Grand Akuma, I knew one day it would come back and get me. Because it is true, you reap what you sow. But are you built for it, Sweeney? Are you built for that? Are you built for the pain? Are you built for the sadness that comes along with this path you're choosing? Because I tell you right now, you stand on your own with this path, Sweeney. You're, you're your own island. Are you truly ready? Are you truly ready to, to feel the bruises, the scars, the sacrifices of choosing this path? Because tonight, we're going to see if you really are ready. Because now it's more personal than ever. It was personal before, but now you're trying to take away my career. Tonight, Larry Sweeney, you will feel the pain and you will feel the joy of a man who was never a boy. The last of a dying breed, Eddie Kingston. Boom.